Breaking at this hour, a seven-year-old Knox County student is recovering after a car hit him at a bus stop. It happened at about 7.30 Thursday morning in southeast Knox County. 10 News reporter Olivia Daig is live in the newsroom with the new details we're learning. And Olivia, the police report says the driver of the car says he slowed down, but not enough. Heather, John, that police report goes on to say the man who hit the child told deputies, I'm not saying I'm innocent here. I understand I'm not. The report identifies the man who hit the seven-year-old little boy as John Yeager. It happened on East Hendron Chapel Road at a bus stop. That's about two miles away from New Hopewell Elementary School where the bus was headed. Yeager was cited for reckless driving and for driving around the school bus with its yellow lights on. Now, the school district is reminding drivers to stay vigilant, especially when it's dark outside. There are signals bus drivers make to let drivers know to slow down or stop, and they say that's for a good reason. Those amber lights ought to come on uh, when they're uh, about 200 yards before they make a bus stop. And then once they've stopped, the red lights will come on and the stop arm will come out. So if you see a bus coming down the road, be looking for those things. Rural Metro did provide aid to the boy who was hit. He was transported to UT Medical Center with minor injuries. And we know that boy is OK and at home recovering. The rest of the kids that were supposed to be on the bus got on another one and then went to school. Parents were notified from the principal of New Hopewell Elementary. The school says they're offering counseling to kids who might need it. John, Heather. It's good to hear that little boy is doing well. Thank you. Appreciate your story, Olivia Dagg, on it.